Don't strike yet, don't strike yet, Dennis. He's scoffing it, scoffing it. We got him. So winter's here, the carp have really switched off. That doesn't mean we stop fishing, we're here for the predators now. Today I'm fishing a dead bait roach and I'm also chucking a few lures around, which is something I do quite often whenever I get five minutes free. It also gives me a good opportunity to look at the banks and I'm always looking at the water, looking for new spots, new fish, new areas and put bait in if I see any of those things. It gives me a good opportunity to take my family fishing with me and yeah, it just keeps me busy, keeps me fishing. And it's something I've done for a long time, way before carp fishing, and I absolutely adore it. So um, yeah, without further ado, let's throw some more lures around, see if we can put a new roach on this, and hopefully get a pike or two. It's fishing really slow today because we've had a big, uh, a big frost. But let's go. Morning. I'm liking the look of that really snaggy overhang there. A couple of chucks there. And by them reeds up in front just before the bridge. Looks like another good place. I don't know how well you can see this in the water, but these frogs swim crazy. Let's have a few chucks with them. There's a rubbish cast. That didn't take long. <laughs> Little Jack straight away. And go for that. Got my mate. Wasn't bad then, was it? First chuck, first fish. Come on, mate. Right. See if we can have another few of them. A few chucks along this reed line. Yeah, it's proper bleeding, that is. Don't mess with Jack Pike. I'm from not being able to buy it, but I like to fish a truck.
kayak gini Si Spike sama si Fen Ya Yes Hold the other end of it and then it'll dangle in. Scott, you're missing all these. Whoa, cool. Do you want to catch one yourself? Alright, so come here. Happy? I'm throwing back. <laughs> yeah. Got another one, Scarlett. Hang on. I think he's just took our fish. Okay. Yes. Don't strike yet, don't strike yet, do you know? scoffing it, scoffing it. We got him. You ready with that net? Put the net in the water. Put the net in the water. Well done, you got him. Lift the net up. Hey! He's a naughty boy. Yeah. Let's have a look at him. Wow! Oh, nice pike, isn't it? He's beautiful. He is beautiful, do right. We do. He's got big teeth, though. So, what we're going to do. Came out for 10 minutes. Little madam next to me. First little Jack. On drop shot of dead baits. <laughs> so as I mentioned in my little intro, I started fishing really for a big fish through pike fishing. And I've been lucky enough to have pike up to 27 pound. My usual spots as well where I've always fished. But uh, yeah. Sort of, as I've got older and I've started taking my little girl fishing, I've got a taste for it again. Just because you can normally buy a bite or two, especially in colder weather, and it keeps her busy. So, yeah, happy dad when she catches. But, yeah, we're on the way to the cut again. See if we can get some more perch. Yeah. Yeah, they were. I got another one. This time, I'll take your picture with him. Sit down. Good 
a lot of cat ice on the cut this morning. First time I've seen that this year. Won't be having a cast here then. to let it float back. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and it's given you an insight into what I do when I'm not actually carp fishing. Um, I've got plenty more videos coming up, plenty more day tickets, got a massive river fishing video coming out which I'm really enjoying doing and uh, yeah just as usual having a wonderful time. So till next time I'll see you in the next video. Oh yeah don't forget to subscribe hit the bell button, give it a like, give it a share, do what you've got to do. Thanks.